I just got to the grocery store and I'm getting ready to go in here in a minute. I've just been super stressed this morning. I just tried to film this a second ago, but my stupid iPhone didn't record it. Um, but yeah, I forgot to say hi to you guys. Um, so hi. And I'm going to start vlogging. Um, it's really hard for me to vlog because I work a full-time job during the week, but I was thinking that I might start vlogging on the weekends or maybe during the week if there's something exciting going on. Um, so yeah, I want to start doing that because I love watching other people's vlogs and in the past when I have vlogged like vacation vlogs and stuff, I have really enjoyed it. So yeah, but I've just been really stressed. I don't know. Um, my computer, it was like completely full and I had no memory to do like finish editing my videos this week and I had to like clear out stuff and I'm like not the best with computers. <sighs> and Nick used to be really, well, he still is good with computers, but like as you guys know, we're not together. So I have to try to figure out this stuff on my own and yeah, I finally got it all worked out, but I'm just going to go ahead and go into the grocery and get the stuff I need for this week. And I will see you guys here in a little bit. So I finally got back home from the grocery store and I do not know what in the heck was going on today. The grocery store was packed and it's not normally like that on Sunday mornings. I don't know if it was because it was so nice outside this morning and it's still super nice out today. Um, like it's not too hot and it's just like perfect weather. So I don't know if that's why it was so crowded or what it was, but it was packed and it was like one of those times when... Every time you made a turn, there was somebody right there, or if you were down an aisle and somebody made a turn, like, they almost ran into you. It was like everybody was playing bumper cars or something. It was so annoying. <laughs> I hate grocery trips like that. That's why I usually go to the grocery really early to, like, beat the traffic of everybody being in there, because that just literally drives me crazy. It's, like, one of my biggest pet peeves. Um... <laughs> But I am getting ready to go inside and I will show you guys what I got at the grocery today and kind of what I eat during the week. So, oh, can you see Specky's? She's right by the window. She always does that whenever people come home. She's like a little dog. <laughs> She's like, yay, you finally got home. Hey, Specky's, are you glad that I come home? Have you just been laying there in the sun? See, does the sun feel good? Huh? She's like, leave me alone. I was relaxing and you just disturbed me. Okay, so I just brought all of my groceries in. And I didn't really get a whole lot. Um, I got some baby spinach. I usually like to fix um, salads for my lunch during the week. Um, and then, whoops, I got some cherry tomatoes. And I got some eggs. I always eat like a ton of eggs. And I know that some people flip out about that and they say that like eggs have a lot of cholesterol. It's bad for you. But I mean if you just research it, it's really not. That's like a, a thing that people used to think was the case. But it's not the case anymore. And I love eggs so much. So I got two cartons of those. And then I got some sweet and hot peppers from a salad which... These really aren't the best for you because they have high fructose corn syrup and a bunch of other like not so great things in here. But I'm sorry, I really like these. <laughs> okay, so I just went ahead and took the stuff out of the bag because that was just annoying. I got some string cheese and um, some really ripe bananas because I like to cut those up and freeze them for my smoothies. I got some unsweetened coconut milk for my smoothies. And then this is going to be like kind of a mini haul. <laughs> um, I got some Pantene Beautiful Links uh, strengthening uh, shampoo. I usually use the conditioner, but I decided to pick up some of the shampoo. 
Um, and I saw my friend Candace. She did a review on this mascara, and I saw it today at Meyer. So I wanted to pick it up and test this out. I'll probably do like a review on it. But have any of you guys used this yet? And what do you guys think about it? Do you like it? Do you not? Um, so yeah. And then I also got another Brow Fix Brow Kit because I've been needing to pick this up. They finally had it at the store and the Milani eyeshadow primer. And then I'm sure you guys probably already saw my e.l.f. haul, but in that haul I told you I didn't know if that foundation and concealer was going to work right for me, and I don't think it's going to. So I picked up this color in porcelain, which is the lighter shade, and I also picked up this concealer, the HD Lifting Concealer by e.l.f. in light, because I had fair and it looked way too light. Um, I got some more Dove soap, because that's what I use to wash my face and my makeup brushes and makeup sponges. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all I picked up at the grocery today. So I just wanted to introduce you guys to two more little kittens that we had just show up at our house. Um, I showed you all Oreo in one of my more recent videos, um, but yeah, we have two other little kittens that just showed up, so we took them in. So our house is starting to become like the crazy cat lady's house, because <laughs> we have like five cats now. Yeah, we have five. Um, so yeah, I'll show you the little kittens. They're so cute. What you doing, Callie? Are you being silly? Are you being a silly kitty? Yeah, don't jump on me. <laughs> Are you stuck? Oh, Teddy's gonna come save you. <laughs> but they're both like very active and they're both super cute. There's Oreo. So you guys have met Oreo. Say hi, Oreo. What you doing? It's such a beautiful day today. Like, it is so pretty outside. I just want to come outside and edit my videos. I need to get a laptop so I can actually do that. And people fly up and down our road. Like, they're crazy. Alright, little kitties. I'm going in. Yeah, so I forgot to tell you guys earlier whenever I was in the car. Another reason why I've been kind of stressed out lately is because... Uh, my grandma, she moved in with us. She hasn't been doing too well. Um, so my mom, my mom moved her in to live with us. And I'm sure most of you guys know that I'm currently living with my parents and I'm saving up money to get a house. Um, so yeah, it's just like another dynamic. And I feel like there's a ton of people that live here and this house isn't very big. Um, you know, it's me, my mom, my dad, and my grandma now. So but I think it's going to be better for her because she was not doing well at all. And she just needs to be around other humans. Because um, she was just living by herself. Because um, my grandpa, he passed away about four years ago. Um, so yeah, that's just another thing that's just been kind of weighing on my mind. And it's just been just stressful. Um, you know, I don't really do very well with change. So it makes it really hard for me. But 
yeah that's what's going on there so now i'm just prepping my lunches for the week so i've got my four containers there because i work four days during the week at my job outside of youtube and i'm just going to put some boiled eggs in my salad and i'm putting some cherry tomato some red onions those sweet peppers that I bought at the grocery, some string cheese that I also got at the grocery, and then baby spinach. So I'm just in the process of pilling the eggs right now. I know, super exciting life. Okay, so before I pour um, my coconut milk in there because it'll like hide everything, I'm making a smoothie for lunch and I put some kale in the bottom there because I was putting it at the top but it always gets caught up on the blade so I'm going to see if this works a little better. Um, I put some strawberries in there, some frozen strawberries, um, like a handful of frozen raspberries, a handful of frozen grapes, and a handful of frozen blackberries. And then I'm also going to add some chia seeds in there. And then I'm also going to add this acai powder, which it's also like a superfood. And then here is the finished smoothie. We'll see how it tastes. It's a little tart, but I like tart smoothies. Um, I know some people don't, but I do. It's really good. Okay, so now I'm just going to edit for a little bit. Um, it's like 2.02 right now. I want to try to be done with this in like an hour because I want to go to the park. It's a nice space I have going on there. That's just what I'm going to be working on. Hopefully it's just going to take me an hour to get this thing finished editing and finalized and uploaded and scheduled for tomorrow. Okay, so I finally made it to Cherokee Park and this place is packed today. I usually don't come this late in the day, but there are so many people here. So I don't know how much I'm going to vlog because I'm not really comfortable vlogging around people a whole lot. Um, so I'm going to try to be discreet about it so I don't feel like such a weirdo. Um, but yeah, I'll try to show you all some really pretty places here in Cherokee Park. Whoa, that person is nuts. So the light, the lighting is really bad in my little living room space that I have here at my parents' house. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry if this lighting doesn't really look that great, but I just got home from walking at the park and I made a couple of stops on the way home. So it's pretty, it's not real late. It's only about seven o'clock now, but I stopped by Kidoba and, um... I'm going to have some Kidoba for dinner. Sorry if that was completely out of focus when it was on me because 
my camera was like out of focus. So I just got me like a naked burrito thing that has a lot of guacamole on it. And I got some chips and guacamole. So the chips aren't really the most healthiest thing ever, but whatever, I don't care. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to eat this and chill for the night and just probably watch some YouTube. Um, yeah, so I don't have much else going on tonight. I'm just going to kind of relax and then go to bed. So um, I hope that you all enjoyed my vlog today. If you guys did, please let me know. Thumbs up this video or let me know down in the comments so I know to continue to do vlogs for you all. Um, if you guys really liked it, um, I'd like to try to start doing a vlog once a week or once every other week. We'll just kind of see how it goes because um, sometimes my life really isn't that interesting and I didn't really feel like it was too interesting today, but I try to make it interesting for you all. Um, but yeah. I will see you all in my next video, and I hope that you all have an awesome weekend. Bye-bye.